Here's a 2016 Dodge, Dodge Dart SXT, 53,000 mile, one owner with a clean Carfax in black. Really good looking vehicle here with a black on black with a, a wheels there, as you can see, smoked out headlamps, all black front end. Uh, tough segment to get vehicles in these days, uh, time of year for efficiency. Good efficiency, good gas mileage cars here, and this is a pretty nice one. Now you can see the, like I said, good looking blacked out front grille, smoked out lights, high definition headlamps. Does have the uh, LED fogs and the lower bumper fascia. And as I pointed out at the beginning of the video, you do have the black painted five spoke rim. You can see a brand new rotor, thick brake pad. Tires here are like new, if not new. And that's one thing we really pride ourselves here at Thomas. We do a used car mechanical check on all our vehicles. You can find the results of that inspection signed off by the technician that performed it in the glove box of all of our cars. You can see it's got a nice little black and red kind of theme going on on the exterior and the uh, interior, as you can see, with the cloth covered external bolster gray seats with the red inserts. Uh, also, you can see the dark charcoal dash and uh, and uh, otherwise brushed aluminum accents throughout the door panel. Of course, you got an automatic floor shifter there as well, big touch screen. Uh, now this of course in the compact uh, sedan segment, but you can see still ample leg hip and shoulder room for your rear occupants there in the back. And also again, just showing you blacked out wheels, light new tires. Again, nice uh, shiny new rotors on the back there as well, working away to the back. Again, you can see it is equipped with factory backup camera. Of course, it's a dark. Let's go ahead and pop the uh, trunk release here. As you can see, even though it's an economy car, you still have ample uh, cargo space. Of course, you can't fold down those seats there if you got something too large to fit in the trunk. It is equipped with an air pump, no rear uh, spare tire. Fix the flat in the air pump. It's kind of common in the compact segment these days, working our way around. And you can see a couple little nicks and dings on the wheel, not too bad. Tires all matching, same tread depths. A shot from the driver's side here, very clean interior, no rips, tear stains or odors. Smells good inside. Manual adjustment driver and passenger seat. Also, want to show you is we guarantee two keys. Is equipped with a factory remote start. It's your keyless entry and your power trunk release. And also, your locks, windows, mirrors, all located right on the door there. Let's go ahead and jump in. Key in the switch and turn it on. Show you the exact miles. 53,000 and some change. As it loads up here, 53,460. Also, like to show you, we do keep a copy of the auto history report right on the dash. You can see there, top score. Only one owner. Clean accident history. Let's go ahead and continue the tour. We got your headlamp controls over here. You push for fogs, automatic headlamp setting. There's your dimmer for your cluster and your interiors. Intermittent wiper washers, turn signals, high beams on this left stem. Does is equipped with the Bluetooth technology. There's your configuration on your center console. You can see how got your trip A, trip B, distance to empty, average mile per gallon, instant mile per gallon, tire pressure monitoring, your oil life, different other settings. There's your compass and your digital speedometer. Uh, is equipped with a factory nav, as you can see there as well. Very well loaded up car, AM, FM, and satellite radio. Uh, does have your ability to pair your phone. See it has heated cloth seats, another nice feature. Dual climate control with automatic temperature setting, another button in the center for your heated seats. Again, there's your full screen nav. Again, ability to pair your phone. MP3 files, either through Bluetooth, uh, auxiliary input direct. And then of course, then you got your extra settings as well. Uh, manual controls down below does have your ability to turn off your traction, your hazards there. Uh, 12 volt power supply below that. Floor shifter does give you the ability to select any of the gears of the automatic transmission here by tapping down to uh, downshift and up, or up to downshift and down to upshift. You've got uh, two cup holders there, pull handle for your emergency brake. More connectivity, there's your aux USB and another 12 volt power supply. Manual flip on your uh, dim on your mirrors there. Illuminated visor, so does have that. LED map lights here. So it mean, doesn't have a roof, but other than that, very, very well equipped with a nav and a remote start. He did cost seats. Let's go ahead and pop the hood. Hood release right there. Should be a variable valve time, didn't line. Four cylinder engine. I believe it's normally aspirated, non turbo. Say 2.4 liter, 
very clean, very quiet. Wood billet has 53,000 miles. See no corrosion on the battery terminals. All your essential fill points are designated with these yellow caps and dipstick handles. Makes it easy to navigate. Keep your vehicle in good running order. Let's go ahead and shut it off. We'll get into the last portion of the video. And as I explained, the mechanical evaluations kept in the glove box, like I said, good new tires and brakes on this vehicle. Uh, uh, the auto histories on the uh, dash. Right now, I'm just gonna give you some cosmetic imperfections. There's a few, uh, nothing uncommon. A few little stone chips and minor scratches I noticed here when I was walking around. Um, obviously, a vehicle, black vehicle, would spend some time in the road. We're gonna have picked up a few little stone chips. Uh, no dents or dings, really, to speak of. Uh, just some minor little chips and scratches pretty much on every panel here. Um, Nothing hateful, very minor. A little bit of bug damage. A little smudge there, a little smudge there. Top of the deck lid's got a couple of little sap or bugs, bird spots here that are into the clear. But like I say, very common. A uh, little brush there on the rear. A couple of little cluster scratches there on the fascia. A few more chips on the corner. Um, chip over here on the wheel well. Upper roof line looks good as a small dent. You probably can't pick it up on the camera. I can tell you there's a little roof dent there, a little scratch there, a couple little bird spots up here as well. Uh, down the door, again, a few little minor scratches here. All in all though, guys, really not bad condition at all. A little bit of bird and bug damage across the front clip here. I'll just quickly pan across versus showing you every single spot, but obviously the aerodynamics of these vehicles and across the hood as well. You're gonna get some stone chips, some bug damage, but really guys, still does have some remainder of uh, the factory warranty on the powertrain level, transferable from Dodge to the next owner, so you can buy this vehicle with confidence. If you're interested, there's a few ways of getting a hold of us. Look us up on the web, www.thomasata.com, or give us a call at area code 717 Again, my name is Kevin Richards. I appreciate your time watching this video. I hope you found it beneficial, and I wish you an excellent day.